I want you now just to prepare for the guided meditation. Closing your eyes and breathing in deeply and exhaling fully. With each in breath, taking in the, the new levels of consciousness and awareness that is available to you in this now. And with each out breath, the release all that no longer serves you in order for you to be shining lighter and lighter, brighter and brighter. And just allow this tone, this vibration, this frequency to go in, through and around your body as you just relax with slow, deep breaths. Wherever you hold any disharmonious energies within you, and specifically due to the news, so just detach, release and let go of all those energies now. Breathe it out, breathe it out, breathe it out. Let it go, set it free, let it be. Thirdly, surrender and release in this moment in time. Begin into a deeper level of peace and relaxation with full awareness. Now, when you just uh, to visualize yourself now. Once again, uh, stepping into a most beautiful garden, forest area. Your piece of sanctuary, serenity, neutrality. And just breathe in uh, the beautiful energies and frequencies that, that is available within uh, this beautiful nature setting. I want you to venture through this beautiful nature to a place uh, that you would like to go and sit at. within the cave of a mountain or on top of the mountain or by the river or by the sea or amongst the, the huge trees or wherever you choose to today go there Find yourself now sitting comfortably within your sacred space. Breathing in the peace, uh, breathing in the harmony. Breathing in there, these beautiful energies. And I want you now just uh, to become aware of uh, any place in your life and your experiences and your thought forms and your belief systems uh, where there is a division or possibly even at war with yourself or wondering why wherever there is a judgment about a situation and experiences on this earth plane that confuses you or any confusion within yourself. 
any dividedness, I want all those memories, thought forms, belief systems to come to the surface now, to become aware of that. Those divided thoughts, divided uh, beliefs, divided feelings. This is personal for each of you. This allows spirit now to bring them all to the surface, to your memory, to the foreground. Telepathically, seeing of the visions, feeling the feelings. This is a time for introspection, only focusing on self. Or if it has been outside, bringing it back to self. And then I invite you now to transcend these. I invite you to take it to uh, to the third point of neutrality, the space of the Holy Ghost, seeing it from a higher vantage point. Each of the, the low vibrational feelings, uh, experiences, thought forms, A victimhood was triggered within you. Transcend that. If safety and security issues uh, was triggered, transcend that. If blame or guilt uh, was triggered, transcend that. If feelings of being powerless was triggered, transcend that. If heartache and pain was triggered, transcend that. If corruption or lies uh, was triggered, uh, transcend that. If veils of illusion is still triggered, uh, transcend that.
if your attachment to, to the lower dimensional frequency is, uh, is still being triggered to transcend that If there's anything in your life uh, that uh, trans uh, uh, or reveals to you any level of self sabotage, transcend that. Or what we do to another, we do to ourselves. Wherever there's been an excessive emotional charge for you in the past day, week, month, or this year, Transcend uh, that emotionally charged experience, thought form that has become your belief system. Whatever judgment uh, you've made uh, about uh, this year or your life, transcend that. Wherever you feel yourself uh, being stuck, stuck in the mud, stuck in quicksand, uh, being absorbed by the collective consciousness and where they go, transcend that. I want you now to become aware of uh, the stairway, the step that the spirit uh, has always uh, had for you on what your focus should be. Following uh, the divine teacher within yourself. that has always known your way, your path, your truth. Asking uh, that uh, the highest uh, teacher and guide that is within you now, step forward and take your hand. And I want you to walk together up these steps, leaving the past behind, the past you, the past way of thinking, feeling, acting and reacting. Becoming lighter and lighter, shining brighter and brighter. Raising yourself down to higher levels in frequencies and awareness and consciousness. And as you get to the top, I want you just to step through, be it the archway, be it the door, whatever it is, step through. I 
I want you to become aware of all that is possible for you, all that is available to you. Allowing yourself now to become a magnet of all this, all that is possible, all that is available. Allow your internal magnets to switch on to be at the, this vibrational frequency. Whatever judgments you have uh, ever made uh, that has prevented yourself from magnetizing this into your life, just detached and transmute uh, that judgment. Whatever comes to mind now, wherever you've stood in your way for this, for these experiences. Devo and transmuted. Let this be your now, your focused intention. And if uh, during uh, the day, the week, uh, the month, uh, you feel yourself dropping down, stand up and rise up again. Step into this now moment more frequently. Don't allow others uh, to draw them into their chaos, into their drama. Know this to be your truth. Feel the total utter peace and tranquility that's uh, within you the harmony, the serenity, the neutrality. Acknowledge within you that you are creator with the source of all that is. Claiming back your power, standing in your magnificence, standing in your truth. Was your head held high? Humble and at peace. With total openness, a 
and full allowance and creating your heaven on earth. I'm asking uh, that uh, your team reveal themselves now to you. Walking beside you, in front of you, and behind you. Being in tune with uh, these masters, teachers, and guides. Becoming one with your divine. I am presence. One with your inner child. One with all parts of you. Totally integrate uh, the whole year. Choosing to feel, think, experience, act and react from your I am present at all times. And in the, the sense of oneness and wholeness and completeness. Gently descend, descend, descend back into your body, back into this now. And then I want you just to visualize the most beautiful silver golden bubble of light coming in all around you. See it coming down the front of your body, the back of your body, the left side and the right side of your body and gently tuck beneath your feet, two feet below you. Now visualize the grounding cord, any color of your choosing, which take deep down into the earth, into the crystal heart of mothers and wrap your grinding cord around the crystal of your choosing. Feel those crystalline energies coming back up your grinding cord and into your silver golden bubble of light, recharging, revitalizing and re-energizing your new energy and frequency and your cellular structure to adjust there to these new frequencies. But all the degree and glass of water today, following this meditation. And slowly rotate your hands, rotate your feet, stretch and make sure that you're properly back into your body. And when you are, you may open your eyes. Hello, hello. <laughs> you're all back. So who would like to share what they've experienced in meditation? Anyone? Are you feeling? I think we are just Yeah, it was very, for me, it, it just went very, very deep. I felt very far away. Um, and I, some stuff that I, We came, that came up in our sessions last week. Um, surprised by one or two little things, but different my perspectives of them uh, felt like some of those were were shifted. Um, but saw some new ones that needed attention, 
and yeah, quite quite significant. I felt that that was very deep. There was a lot of work going on there. So thank you for that. Very, very powerful. Thank you. Thank you, Maria. Thank you. Barbara. Um, yeah. I Sorry, I, I haven't been able to unmute myself until now because I lost you guys. And so I'm trying to work Zoom from my phone, which I'm not too familiar with. Um, I thought it was a wonderful meditation and I couldn't stop thinking about the importance of what people were saying about the how you make someone a victim by seeing them as a victim. It just kept coming up in my meditation and how we make ourselves feel like victims by seeing ourselves as victims also. So, yeah, that, that was just going through my mind during meditation. I also went very deep, felt a lot of peace, and I didn't really have anything to release. It was just, I felt like I had released, um, I've released a lot of stuff. <laughs> And I didn't really feel I needed to release anything. I just felt completely at peace and 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 joy, you know, because when you have no negative emotions, it makes room for positive emotions that make you feel good. So thank you. It was lovely. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Anything you'd like to end off with? I had a wonderful time. Thank you. Um, <laughs> as the meditation started, I saw it pictures. Most countries are divided by a river and because you are on one side of the river and I'm on the other, we often have to fight about something. <laughs> and the river runs as purely neutral in between these countries. It's you are not good and you are not good you, I am just a neutral force. And the river runs or flows to the sea. Where all the angers that have been put on boats onto the river from either side is taken to the sea where the water is so vast that it is neutralized. And salt is a good antibiotic or neutralizer or whatever we want to call it. And so all this anger is um, neutralized. And th this is again the the peak of the of the triangle where the the angers, the hurts, the even the loves are put into the boat and can go across the river and let it just be neutralized. And then I saw the masters. The masters are and have been around here, lots of them. Um, but it seemed to be like there were three on one side and three on the other and then three in the middle. So it's just a, a, a joining. And then went through the gates, whatever. I went through the, the top, the crown chakra. <laughs> <laughs> so I went through there and it was just pure light, um, neutral, just energy. And then I finished there and the meditation was still going on. <laughs> and um, I opened my eyes and there's a little dustbin here with a silver lid. And it was swaying away, just neutral, just balancing everything. And I thought, well, there's the message there in the dustbin. <laughs> so, yes, that was my... I feel such peace and yes, um, it, it, it was wonderful. I really enjoyed 
And thank you all for your company because it makes a world of difference. Thank you. What's your parting message? Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> um, yes, a lot of personal growth happened here. Um, I, I have a lot of, or I, well, I had a lot of fear for those I'm leaving behind here. Um, my two children and my dog. <laughs> me and that dog um, so I just realized all the attachments I'm, I, want, I, I had them in bubbles of protection and I was holding it like a bunch of balloons so I was tethering them to me and they couldn't fly and they, I need to let them go so that they are in the bubble of protection and they're going to be fine but I can't keep them back and for my own good as well for my own enjoyment of this whole new part of my life if if i don't let that go that attachment go um, i'm going to be unhappy so i've got to yes and then there was this dog barking so it was my <laughs> dog just talking to me every time i i, I felt him the dog barked so oh. i was yes i was feeling very close to my baby um yes and then at the end, when you were gonging the gong, my mouth started twitching. It was the weirdest thing. And it just, I was like the joker. And every time the gong went, it just, and I was smiling. Um, it was weird, but I was quite happy. Uh, awesome. <laughs> was big. awesome. Awesome, awesome, Thank you. I've been asked to give you a pair of scissors of love oh, to wow. cut the cords. Thank you. I need that. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Okay, yeah, and I also felt that they're very peaceful. Um, uh, yeah, just um, just very aware and very present. Um, and loved all the messages that, that came through. It's, a, it's, a, it's amazing how everything comes together and just you get a, a new sense of a, awareness. And oh, Okay, yes, this is what my attention should be on. Okay, yes, I can do this. So I've, I've, I'm very in a, in a much better space now. I love this space. Oh, is that what? I thought, yeah. where was it swaying? Beryl was showing me because the wind is swaying the, the, um, dustbin. the dustbin's lid and it's uh, going like this. Because so, I thought, sort of, it's static. Like, where was it moving? But now I see it. The, the, the spirit's uh, <laughs> waking you up waking us up <laughs> everything is in balance everything is perfect. absolutely it's balancing perfectly yes hmm. and then it's neutral hmm. so whatever sways in your life this week let it sway and be on the swing but have no emotional attachment to either because uh, it will settle down and uh, have a positive expression about that, that settle down energy is like okay, this is showing me things are shifting. Okay, but there's it. I'll it will be replaced with something good or better. Um, don't to focus on anything else but that. And we are, you know, the the Aquarian age is all about creating now win-win situations. It's, as the book said, it's like in the past there was a winner and a loser, and nobody has to be a loser. You don't have to see yourself losing anything. It is. What are you winning in the process? The doggy will win another new home that will create love <laughs> and affection and attention and it will give you freedom of exploration and so forth. And as long as he's so taken care of and love, and the, he, he might have signed up for a two-man contract. You mm. did the first phase <laughs> and it's to trust uh, that he will, he will, you will be replaced by something like you or better. Mm. And, um, and do that, everything that we do in love, give over and surrender in love. Yes, I love it. <laughs> Go. Wish you all a magical week. Bye-bye. And thank you. Go. Go, well, Go. Thank you. Bye. Thanks. Bye. 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 Bye.